Sean Mosley, thanks for stopping by. Sport Eagle TV's Basketball Insiders. It's been a rough season for Crowdsheim. You guys showed some spirit, but uh, not a lot of wins to show for it. Um, what have you learned in your first year here in Crowdsheim? Uh, I just learned that the BBL is a, is a tough lead to play in. Um, you know, we come out and just try to fight hard each and every game. We know um, the position that we're in. Uh, when I first got here in October, uh, teams didn't have any wins, but you know, when I got here, we beat Trier. But you know, every game is tough. Um, there's no easy games here in, in the BBL. How would you say the game's different? Uh, you played in other countries in Europe. How was the German league? As you said, it's tough, but compared to the other leagues and, and also your game, how is it suited uh, for Germany? Uh, Germany, the BBL is probably like the top league that I played in uh, by far. Um, you know, like I say, every night is, is a tough game. It's not a game you come out here and just, you know, cakewalk through a game. Um, but for me, I, I like playing physical, um, getting into guys and playing physical on defense and offense. So for me, uh, it's not a big adjustment for me. I play, you know, uh, in the ACC, tough, tough opponents. So coming here in the BBL is, is not, it's not a big adjustment for me. Just trying to get familiar with the teams because um, I don't, I didn't pretty much know any of these teams uh, before I came here. So just getting familiar with the teams and the style and the way they play. For me, it was a big adjustment, but nothing like physical or mentally, nothing like this, uh, not anything that affect my game or anything like that. I'm glad you reminded me about reminded me about the ACC. You played at Maryland. You're no longer there. Is it easy to root for an, uh, another ACC team? I know Duke's going for the Final Four, or is it still? Uh, do you still have your "I hate Christian Leitner" uh, uh, t-shirt hidden away? <laughs> I'll have that t-shirt hidden away, but um, now we moved to the Big Ten, so ACC teams I really don't even watch anymore. But uh, don't root, don't root, uh, root for Duke at all. You know, for me, diehard Maryland fan. Um, I knew I was wanting to go to Maryland since I was 10 years old. So for me, I always root for Maryland no matter what. Not another team in college basketball. Good luck the rest of the way. Hopefully, get some more wins. All right, thank you. I appreciate it. Garrett Sim, thanks for stopping by Basketball Insiders. No it's been a tough season for you guys. Not a lot of wins. You personally, your first season on the, on the club. What have you guys learned? Um, I think we, we've learned uh, that you got to bring it every night in the uh, in this league, and uh, you know it's people people will take advantage if you uh, if you don't bring 100. percent So you know we've been uh, just trying to fight every night, and uh, uh, it's been tough, but we're, we're I feel like we're doing a good job of trying to give effort. So now, about you, how, how do you feel your game has developed and improved while playing basketball in Germany? Um, I think, you know, the, the European game is a little different, but I feel like I've acclimated well. Um, you know, it's, I'm, uh, I feel like shooting is a, is a strong point of mine, and, and that's, that's uh, big in the European game, a lot of open shots. So I feel like I'm adapting pretty well. Now we're talking to you during March Madness. Have you had a chance to watch the games and watch your team? Um, yeah, I watched uh, the Oregon games. Unfortunately, they got beat by a good Wisconsin team. But uh, yeah, it's exciting to follow. And, uh, you know, March Madness is a, is a great time. It's a great time for sure. I'm asked all the time, why don't we have uh, March Madness in Germany in the sense of the universities in Germany? But, but do you feel um, Germans following college basketball um, in the States as much uh, as, as we do? Um, they definitely don't know as much, uh, you know, uh, we, we made a, a pool among our team and the Germans uh, definitely don't know the teams as well, but uh, I think uh, it's, it's getting well known. Basketball in Germany, I feel like, is making great strides and uh, we're playing really good basketball in Germany, so I feel like uh, the BBL is in a good spot. Last question, of course the team doesn't look like it's going to stay in the Bickle BBL. How much would that affect your decision whether or not you stay with Crossheim or, or if you stay in Germany? Um, yeah, I, I have no idea what's going to come uh, as far as next year. Um, you know, we're in a, we're in a low spot, but uh, we're just going to keep fighting till the end, and and that's all you can do. You know, be a professional about it and uh, try and win as many games as we have left. So, best of luck the rest of the season. Yeah, thank you very much. Thanks for having me.